I've been coming here since I was 12, and it's always been a dream of mine to work in Long Point. So working with this project has been really cool to see some of the, the places I used to come as a kid, and now I actually get to go work in them. My name is Dylan Buch. Uh, I work for Scales Nature Park um, under the START project. I'm one of the lead biologists and conservation biologists uh, working with Scales. It comes over, it looks like there's a shine right there. The START project, which is the Saving Turtles at Risk Today project, will go out into uh, remote wetlands and we'll, we'll survey for turtles there and collect a lot of our biometric and GPS data on different turtle species. Um, inside our turtle kits, we have we have calipers, which we use to measure our turtles. So with every turtle that we catch, we assign it a code uh, based on the puzzle pieces or skutes around its shell. It, it's really cool to, to get to see some of this wildlife that not many people appreciate in the way that we do and uh, help it out by, by providing uh, conservation uh, efforts and uh, collecting data and uh, providing protection. A lot of my uh, classmates have focused a lot on policy. I've never been really interested in that. So this has been my approach to, to helping with the environment, is, is focusing on the hands-on side of things. With having ADHD and, and dyslexia, it's, it's tough sometimes to, to stay on topic and to make sure that the deadline happens um, so using different uh, strategies and uh, having others look out for you also is a big thing i'm learning how to manage my own time my own way of organizing and and uh, and leading as well most of our work is is done in the muskoka area so we focus a lot uh, on some of the wetlands up there and uh, that's where we will survey for different turtle species. Can you see the ripples moving? I can see his whole body, but I don't know if the camera will pick that up. As someone who's still pretty new to the environmental workforce and this kind of work, a lot of the challenges that I've seen has, have been retaining really qualified and really like good people. I'm. I'm hoping to see that there's more money poured into it and, and more care taken to, to support projects like this.